Hi, it's Jamie Greenberg, celebrity makeup artist. And last month, I actually created a look for Kaylee Cuoco when she went to the Vera Wang store opening in Beverly Hills. Um, it was kind of a twiggy look and it was a little unexpected and it was really fun. So I thought I would recreate it for you. We're gonna start with an eye primer. The, I use Max Prep and Prime, it's for the eye. And I'm just placing it all over the lid and then blending it with my finger a little bit to thin it out. Next we're going to take this on the dot palette. It's uh, by Mark. It's the smoky palette. And I'm going to use this middle color right here blended with this blue right here. I'm going to blend them back and forth. So I just really took a lot of the eyeshadow and placed it all over the two lids to make it really dark. So now I'm going to use this Tom Ford Traceless Foundation. I'm going, I'm going a tad bit lighter, I mean darker, because I want to look a little bit tan for this look. Sometimes with these darker colors, the paler you are, the more washed out you can look when you add the darker color. So warming yourself up a little bit is not the worst idea in the world. Next, I'm going to place a little bit of powder on. Kind of take down the T-zone. Leaving my cheeks still a little dewy. Uh, and then I'm gonna place the powder very lightly underneath my eyes. I'm gonna take a little bit of this uh, In Lights Smashbox. It's like a highlighter and two different blushes in one. I'm gonna mix all three and give a nice little glow on the cheeks. Okay, so we have the nice complementary colors of this blue and then this nice like peachy orange which is really complimentary. So now is the fun part. We're gonna take a liquid liner in a blue similar to the color that we used on our top of our eye. It's called blue chrome. I'm gonna take a Fran Wilson eye tee. These are called eye tees and they have like a pointy on one and then a swab on the other. And I love these because you can get really detailed with your work. So what I'm gonna say is dip this in the eyeshadow that you use. And then I'm gonna place it where I want the dots to be. But before I put them down with the liquid liner, I'm gonna use powder because it's easier to get rid of. So the first one's gonna be right here, right where my pupil is. Ting, ting. And same on this side. Then I'm gonna do another one. a Couple steps away. And then one more right here. So we have three. And this is Blue Chrome, On the Edge Blue Chrome by Mark. It's a really pretty color. And I'm just going to go in there and reinforce. Dot, 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 dot. Dot, 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 dot. Dot, 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 dot. Now to finish off the eye, I'm going to apply Mega Effects by Avon in black on the bottom lashes. And if I didn't have fake lashes on the top, I would do it there too. So this kind of blends it in a little bit and gives you that like 60s feel. Now we have this really pretty, something different. This eye, lots of little dots on the bottom, just that 60s feel, something different. You can do it in different colors, it's really fun. And now I'm just gonna place this color on my lips. And this is Glow Baby Glow in Gl Glam Lux. And here we are. So I hope you enjoyed my recreation of a look that I actually created for Kaylee Cuoco when she went to the Vera Wang opening. I'm no Kaylee Cuoco, but I tried. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it, I hope you'll try it. Try it out, send it out. Let me, let me know what you think. 
Um, subscribe below and let me know what you guys want to see. I'm happy to tailor these videos for your liking. Have a wonderful week and remember dot dot dot.